Hi there, this is my Yamaha PSR 620 from 1995. It originally came with this floppy disk drive from Matsushita Electronics. It has a 24 pin flexible flat cable and I guess the drive belt caused problems here because of its age, even if I never used the drive. If you install a new floppy drive or want to go ahead for an USB floppy emulator, of course you need the original rails here. I decided to buy a new floppy drive for replacement on Amazon. Costs around 10 euro or 13 US dollars. This flexible flat cable is really easy to damage, so I don't want to disconnect it at this point anymore. But what you need is this 24 pin to 34 pin adapter with the power cable for PC standard. And then you can connect like me a floppy disk drive replacement or the USB floppy emulator. For me the floppy disks are cooler, more nostalgic to use. Some companies even still produce them. And I don't want to use it for MIDI files. So it's just like a memory card, so my keyboard just can save, load the settings. I don't know why the original drive was taped, but I taped my new drive too. Just to be sure not doing anything wrong. If you are using a USB emulator, maybe you have to format your USB stick into FAT 720 kilobyte format. Good emulators have photo directory function. If you're using a real floppy disk like me, tape the other hole because the PSR 620 only read DD disks with 720 kilobyte. The later model, PSR 630, got a newer drive which could read HD disks with 1.44 megabyte. Let's test my custom floppy. Everything seems to work fine with the modern floppy disk drive. Select register bank 1 with the custom settings. Select destination and save. Everything works fine. Will also work with the floppy emulator. Hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching.